It's December 31st, 2012. I can't believe it's New Year's Eve. Another year has come and gone. My friend will be here in two minutes. We're going down to uh, my friends down in St. Augustine to uh, their horse farm. I'm just going to have some drinks and whatever and a bonfire. be good, good times. But um, just, whoa, I was like, I should document something before my friend gets here. And uh, 2012 was a, a rough year. It was also a really good year. I got very close to my grandmother. She also was very ill. I've had a lot of issues with my brother. I've had some health issues. Family stuff has been stressful, but made some cool new friends. Uh, 2013 is looking like it's going to be a good year. At least I hope so. But uh, really, 2012 has been a balance. Like, as much as there's been um, lows, there's been really a lot of significant uh, joy, too. So I've been home this whole year in Florida. A lot of people are kind of confused as to my location, but I've been in Florida since um, July 31st, 2011. I'm trying to think. But um, so I've been here for about a year and a half and um, spending time with my family and saving up money to go back to the West Coast, which that might happen next month. Is it January? Or in, oh, that's my dog. She wants to come in. It's been a good year. I realized a lot of things, done a lot of growth, realized how blessed I am and just trying to keep gratitude in mind and not always being uh, just so upset about my situation, meaning the trans thing, kind of like dysphoria and stuff that I struggled with before. But on a whole, really happy, happy where I'm at. Definitely don't get down about trans stuff as much, even though anxiety comes in ways and stuff. It's, it's been a... Uh, it's definitely been a year of learning, but um, I've had a lot of new experiences, put myself in a lot of situations I've never been in. I mean, like socially and stuff, um, like challenged myself, met the challenges, and it turned out even better than I ever thought. So definitely uh, had some other crappy situations, you know, like getting denied a job because I'm trans and a homosexual because um, they found my YouTube, whatever, being in a more conservative area. It's makes you count your blessings after being in San Francisco and, you know, like just coming out to uh, my landlord in Berkeley, just... She, she was a documentary filmmaker, we're talking, and she's asking what my main subject of my work was, and I actually said, you know, I actually just started because I was um, video blogging my transition from female to male, and then that got me interested in film and whatnot. And, you know, she, like, doesn't even bat an eye. So that's, like, coming out to someone in the Bay Area, but um, here it's, like, you know, either you're less than or you're just a homosexual, and, you know, there's no distinction between a gender identity and sexuality or whatever. But, um, you know, I've been getting to see my old doctor and stuff who I love. And um, so there's good things. And, you know, I've reconnected with old friends and made new friends. So this year has been good. So my friend's going to be here. That's all I want to say. Hope 2013 is awesome for everyone. All right. Take care. Peace, everyone.